The first successful moon landing took place on July 20, 1969, during NASA's Apollo 11 mission. This historic event saw astronauts Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin become the first humans to walk on the moon, while Michael Collins orbited above in the command module. When Armstrong took that iconic first step onto the lunar surface, he uttered the famous words, that's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. These words have since become etched in history as one of the most memorable quotes ever spoken. The moon landing was a significant event in the context of the space race, a competition for space dominance between the United States and the Soviet Union during the Cold War. The U.S. aimed to demonstrate its technological and ideological superiority by successfully landing on the moon. To achieve the moon landing, the lunar module, named Eagle, separated from the command module and descended to the moon's surface. This highly critical maneuver was fraught with tension, as the module had to navigate over a field of boulders and find a safe landing spot with limited fuel. The lunar module was only about the size of a car and had just enough fuel for a single landing attempt. The success of this descent was crucial for the mission's overall success. The moon landing was a global event, with an estimated 600 million people watching it on television worldwide. People from all over the globe were captivated by this momentous event, which marked a significant milestone in human history. During their time on the moon, the Apollo 11 astronauts collected rock and soil samples from the lunar surface. These samples provided valuable insights into the moon's geology and composition, and they continue to be studied by scientists to this day. Subsequent Apollo missions, such as Apollo 14, saw astronauts engage in more light-hearted moments on the moon. Alan Shepard famously hit two golf balls on the lunar surface, taking advantage of the moon's weaker gravity to achieve impressive distances. The Apollo program continued with further missions, including Apollo 15, 16, and 17, which carried lunar rovers, often referred to as moon buggies. These electric vehicles allowed the astronauts to cover more ground and conduct various experiments during their time on the moon. After the Apollo 17 mission in December 1972, no humans have set foot on the lunar surface. However, plans for future moon exploration are currently in progress, and there is renewed interest in returning to the moon for further scientific study and potential future human settlements. As we look back on that historic first moon landing, we are reminded of the extraordinary achievements of the past and the endless possibilities for exploration that lie ahead.